What's going on everyone? On today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to use uh, Unminable Miner to mine Dutchcoin. So um, a friend of mine asked me how to, uh, how do you mine Dutchcoin? And uh, on today's video, I'm going to show you how to do that. So um, stay tuned. This is mining on a uh, Ryzen 2700X with 8 core 16 threads. And uh, as a graphics card, it has a 1080 Ti. You don't have to have this type of specs. But, you know, it's... Um, it's it's useful right so right now this is mining about um, 33 mega hashes per second and even though on the bottom it says that it's hashing uh, a little bit more than that um, so you can see right here uh, the system is saying that it's hashing 37 uh, hashes a second so it's possible that you can get a little bit more um, even though it says 33 mega hashes per second and I want to show you guys these are actually how many coins I mined so far um, so again you know there's um, some profits to be made as you can see and this is not something that's gonna happen right away so I mean we have to let the coin actually build up and stuff like that and uh, just to show you the computer that it's actually on it's gonna be this one right here Sorry, it's kind of dark, but you know. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna go into uh, the studio and I'm gonna show you guys how to actually download the software and set up your miner so you can start mining as well. Stay tuned. So this is my other miner. Right now, this one is actually mining um, Bitcoin. So, yeah, you know, trying to make some money. But let's jump into the computer so I can show you how to download and set up your um, own mineable rig or miner for that matter. Stay tuned. Okay, guys, so welcome to uh, the tutorial how to um, download on Mineable uh, Miner to mine Dogecoin. I'm going to show you today in the computer on how to do it. Uh, it's very simple. We're going to follow step by step. I'm going to do it along so you guys see how to do every single step of the way. Um, with that said, if you like this video, subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up, share if you find it useful. If not, give it a thumbs down. I still appreciate your feedback. Let's get started. So first things first, uh, we are going to uh, go to um, mydutchchange.com or you can just go to, um, I'll show you guys. So let's close this and close that. We're gonna open, we're gonna start fresh uh, from the beginning, right? So. Uh, we're going to go to Dutch change. You just type in the uh, link below, right? And uh, it will come up with this. I will add every single description in here in order for you guys to be able to just go into the site and do it yourself. All right, so we are back in the computer and I'm going to show you guys how to mine Dogecoin using your CPU or your GPU if you want to. Uh, keep in mind, this is only a tutorial for uh, Windows PC. I'm sure that you can probably do it on Mac and Windows, uh, uh, on Mac and stuff like that, but this is only for PC. Um, I, again, just for PC. But before we start with the tutorial, if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. I'll appreciate that. And um, we're gonna go ahead and get started. All right, so we're back in the computer, as you can see. I can move my windows. Um, I can move my window around, right? So we're going to put this window on the corner. Uh, I'm going to minimize it. And what we are going to do, we are going to open a new browser. And we are going to go to dog, 
mydutchchange.info. Uh, I'm going to add all the links in the description below along with every single step that we are doing. So this is step number one. So step number two, you're going to have to create a new wallet. So create a wallet. You're going to have to enter your email address. All right. So once you do that, you're going to create a new password, whatever password you want. Okay. Once you create your password, oh, I don't think it matches. Hold on. All right. Create a wallet. Don't save it if you don't want to save it. So now it's asking you, do you want to create a wallet? You're going to open your wallet. Click open. Um, and here it's your uh, Dogecoin wallet. So what you're going to do, you're going to highlight it, copy and save it somewhere so if you want to save it in a word document this is what i actually wrote uh to do the uh tutorial i'm gonna just save it there right we don't need this right now okay so now that this is open we are going to open a new tab and you are going to go to onminable.com right here the second one all right, so once you're here, you are going to go to downloads. This is step number three. I think it's step number three. Let me check. Uh, okay, that's uh, step um, six. Once you own mineable.com, you go to step seven, which is going to be download. So you click on the download. You will do right click, open, link a new tab. You're going to do that. It's going to download um, the file that you need in order for you to open the miner. You're going to open it. It's going to open in this little window right now. You're going to double click. You're going to hear that beep. Once you hear that beep, it's going to open the miner. So here's the miner right now. You can actually see I'm moving it around. You're going to click continue. Now you can tell the miner what you want to use as a miner. So what type of hardware are you willing to use to do this? You can use your graphics card if you want to, or you can use your CPU. Again, you need a minimum of three gigs of VRAM to be able to do this. For this one, doesn't really matter. Again, as long as you have a powerful, not really powerful GPU, but anything that minimum minimum three gigs of ram that's what you need so we're going to use the gpu just for now so we're going to click next now there's a wallet right here already but that's not the wallet that we want to use right so we want to use a different wallet so remember this is only dutch coin you can also mine all these different coins if you want to but this video is only for dutch coin just a heads up so dogecoin is right on the top you're going to take your wallet right and you do control v as in victor and it will paste your wallet onto the miner itself click start this will take a few seconds and you're going to see this little cartwheel over here on the bottom that starts spinning give it a few seconds and it's going to start mining um your doge your doggy coins say right now as i'm mining uh, at a rate of 54.3 mega hashes per second keep in mind that this computer is a monster computer it has a 3090 graphics card in it with 24 gigs of ram again you don't need something like this but you can start mining with your cpu if you want you're not going to get a better hash rate with your cpu versus your gpu so just keep that in mind okay so I'm going to leave it a, a little bit of, of run time in here just so you can see that it actually is working. I'm going to minimize all of this stuff. So you, the only thing you see is going to be the miner itself. And right now we have nothing. So as you can see, um, you know, 48 mega hashes per second is not horrible, but you could do better. But see, there you go. We started to see some 
yields right now. To see how much do you mining, you can just go to a website, right? And it will pop the mineable on the mineable website right here. And it will tell you how much uh, Dodge coins you actually made so far. You can have it on automatic payment, which means it's going to transfer uh, your Dodge coin to your wallet that you created on step one through seven and you don't have to do it manually on the computer that I show you in my living room that one I do manually because I don't want to just send 50 doge coins that you know every single time it reach 50 to 50 coins I'd rather just do it myself and just get it done myself right so I keep on track on that uh, on the other computer that I have in the living room I'm actually uh, have already like 813 coins that I that I mine in just seven days just keep that in mind okay which roughly equals to about $57 I mean it's not bad but again I'm not doing it to sell them I'm gonna hold on to them and you know let them grow right now I think uh, uh, every dogecoin per coin is like seven cents you know who cares right but we're talking about long term so this is the main goal to keep it for a long term so let it grow whether it reaches a dollar or not I will still hold on to them so Anyway, guys, so that is it. If you find this video useful, please just give, the, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I'll appreciate that. Until the next video, guys, stay safe, be well. I'll see you in the next one. Later.